Good evening, sports fans. Several Southeast Georgia high school baseball teams facing third and deciding games in their GHSA Sweet 16 series. Wayne County, Vidalia, Benedictine, Jeff Davis, Calvary Day all looking to move on to the Elite Eight. Calvary looking to become the third Savannah squad to reach the single eight private quarterfinals. That's because Thursday, Savannah Christian and Savannah Country Day sweeping their Sweet 16 series here in town. The Raiders beating Mount Perrin and the Hornets taking two from St. Francis. Savannah Christian will now host Country Day in the Elite Eight. That best of three series scheduled to start on Wednesday. So Calvary Day needing a win over FPD to join the Raiders and Hornets in the quarterfinals. Vikings with the 2-1 lead early on. Runner on for Barrett Barkley who's going to send a hot shot past third. FPD going to try to add to their lead. I stress try because the throw from left gets the runner at the plate. FPD would be able to build a lead in this one. Parker Ingram stroke with the RBI single out to left center. The Vikings would take a 6-1 lead into the bottom of the fifth. But that's when the Cavalier comeback begins. First, runner on third for the Cavs. FPD going to uncork the wild pitch. That allows Davis Gaylord to race home. Moments later, two on for Grant Thomas, who's going to send one to shallow left center. That's going to find some green grass. Two more runs going to score. And the Cavs are moving on to the Elite Eight. Cavalry Day takes game three in comeback fashion. 9-7 the final. Triple-A, Benedictine hosting Crisp County in game three. Game tied at one in the third. Game tied no more. The natural with the shot to right center. This home run from Carter Holton, a 2-1 job. It was 3-1 Benedictine, but Crisp County going to respond. Now 3-2 game, couple on for Connor Richmond, who's going to line one to left. This one down, allowing two to score. Richmond going to motor all the way to third on the hit. The Cougars going to take the 4-3 lead. Benedictine able to get out of the jam with no further damage. George Mullen has the inning-ending strikeout for the Cadets. BC going to knock things up a short time later. Runner on for Rome Dean, who's going to collect the RBI with the base knock to left. That's going to make it a 4-4 contest, but it... Is it going to happen for Benedictine? Chris County taking the lead for good in the fifth. Couple on for Noah Walters, who knocks the ball out to left. That's going to play one easily. Ball then misplayed out there. That allows another Cougar to race home. And the season comes to an end for Benedictine. Chris County taking the series with the 7-4 victory Friday afternoon. The Jeff Davis Yellow Jackets, they're moving on after a 3-2 win over Fitzgerald. Jeff Davis will travel to Social Circle for their double-A quarterfinal series. The news, not as good for Vidalia and Wayne County. The Indians are done in double-A after an 11-1 loss to Harlem in Game 3. And Thomas County Central edging Wayne County 1-0 to win that 5-A series two games to one.